Hey, what's up? Welcome to another Plan With Me video. My name is Stephanie, and today I'm going to be decorating my classic happy planner for the monthly view of March. And I use this spread as my memory a day spread. And I want to use the pressed florals. Um, I love all the bright, vibrant colors. Also the spring book and the seasonal mega book to pull from. Um, this spread's probably going to end up being bright and colorful and maybe a little crazy. But I do want to use a lot of the boxes in here. And I want to use the shamrocks that are in the mega book and uh, some of these other green St. Patrick's Day stickers as well. And then I think mostly in here I want to use maybe these. I really like these and I keep trying to fit them in somewhere but I'm not sure where they fit. So, we will try to make that work. I think the first thing I'm going to do is try to find some flowers maybe to put down here and up here. But I think this might be a good one for over here. Of course, we have purple on the page that we need to work with. So I think we're going to take maybe this one for the other side. Really weird bottom. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Okay, let's start there and maybe add these guys to it. Add some pink over here. I wonder if I need to pick the one that's going the other direction. Here's, I'm getting a collection now. Where did my um, planner guides go? Let's stick some of those down. So I'm thinking I need this. Move in the background here. And this one. I need to go further down with these though. Okay, that looks cool already. Okay. Let's put this guy back. And then I'm actually thinking I might need to add another flower over here. This one. I don't know if we have any short ones to cut along here. Yes, I don't want to take up too much of these boxes, of course. I'm 
maybe these are smaller. There's a lot of pinks and purples. Quite sure about that. All okay, right, and I'm thinking maybe we use one of these. Maybe spring is in the air. Not sure what I'm going to put here because maybe I'll make like a little border of flowers, like it's a um, strip of washi tape, or maybe I just put a strip of washi tape there. I don't know. Let me think about that. I think what I'm going to do is there's some strips in here. These. I think I'm going to use one of these over here. I'm gonna put some little flowers with it. Oh my gosh, we even have these, they're so cool. I think I might put one of these with it. Make today amazing. That's really well. Longer than I thought it was going to be. That's why. I feel like these spreads, because they end up really full, at the end they can be crazy. And it will be okay. Alright, so now I'm just looking for some little flowers to make a line of little flowers. favorite little guys. I love this sticker book. Okay, and then we definitely need a green box for St. Patrick's Day. this one. Then 
I find a St. Patrick's Day, probably gold. Let's see this one it says St. Patty's Day. I think that's cute. up here. Let's push it down. Get those little air bubbles out. Looks cool already. It was weird to be decorating for spring because it's cold outside, but I am ready for it. I love spring. Um, let's see if I have a gold sticker for Thursday, like saving time. Let's begin. I have a feeling they're all going to be pretty big. So let's use this one. Maybe a yellow box. This blue one is kind of nice too. Okay, I think I'll we'll use this pretty blue box for this. This is Tombow correction tape. And squish that one down too, because it's a clear sticker. Okay, we definitely want something for first day of spring. I think this is going to be way too big. I don't know if I have a first day of spring in here. <clears throat> this is a create your own sticker book. I just put all of my holiday stickers in. Maybe if spring is in bloom. I don't think I'm gonna have room for a box. So let's do this. Let's put this. Let's just put it in here. Hopefully, I don't have anything else I want to put in there that day. So I think that's it for the holidays I'm going to put down. Okay, on the third, we have early release on Fridays, no school. I'm trying to decide if these are too big. I don't think so. And early release this day too. And then for no school, we'll get a sticker to put it in, a box sticker. I might put another blue box on that side. It seems to fit perfectly in this one, but I can't see it like that. Okay. 
then I'm just going to put some decoration and boxes around and then I will have those two work around. I do did want to put more St. Patrick's Day in here though. Here I've done this I think. Let's put that to the side. Have this feeling lucky. And some shamrocks. So let's put this here. Shamrock here. Maybe a little one on the other side. I feel like I might scatter a few more around. that round that off round it out <laughs> okay I want another strip for the other side so what color do we need over there maybe some yellow Feel the sunshine. Oh, and purple. Let's do purple too. Pink. Yeah. Let make the day count. And green. Do like this. Not quite straight. Gonna move it down a tiny bit. There's kind of that little bit of wasted space above where the numbers are. So I feel like I can move into that a little bit. And I think I might put in another strip. Like that. some different colors. Maybe I'll use some of these. So let's start it down here. This one down. I 
feel like I need more down here too. So let's take one of the shorter ones. under the line. What color could I use? The blue maybe. Oh, let's go somewhere. So we need to go somewhere. Okay, then I think we need more boxes. I like this one. I just feel like it's really pretty next to the blue. I don't know, some of these days might need a really big box, but I don't know what day that might be, you know? Maybe right here. my crop a dial disc punch. This is an amazing tool. You can also just use scissors and cut if you don't have one of these. Alright, I think that looks really cool. I think we need a green box over here too. Maybe light green. What else are we missing? Dark blue. These two, I kind of wish they were flipped the other way though. Maybe more green or more, maybe dark purple. We don't have yellow over here yet. So, I'm going to yellow up here. Let's put it above where it says Mardi Gras. Tried really hard to make it not crooked. And some of this red color would be nice too. Maybe what about this purple box? And then let's put light pink down here. I 
just trying to get all the colors on each side. These are so pretty. Okay, and then of course I can write off the boxes as well. Let's get one of these for the other side. Down here, maybe. It's kind of a busy area. I feel like we need another tall box over here, but I don't know. Might have to go off the... Oh, that's kind of perfect, actually. box. I like this one. That one like that. Alright, let's do this. Cute. All right, yellow box. That right here. So tomorrow I have to take my cat to the vet again. Look at this one. She has high blood pressure. And they tried some medicine and seemed to make her blood pressure too low. So I gotta go to that again. It's not. So I get to do that tomorrow. I don't know where I want to put this. How about over Ash Wednesday here? Mm. Wait, I need more. Green, more blue. Or am I done? I think I'm gonna put a shamrock right there. Kind of cover up that white out. Right there, and then right there too. thinking maybe another square box right here. Oh, it's kind of close to green. Maybe a light purple. Cover up 19. The 19th. Do I care? 
No. There are also some other pink ones that I didn't really use. This pink. That might be cool. I'm thinking maybe I need more green over here. So how about this one? Daisy and Daisy. It's all right. And then I think I'll put one here. And I think that will be it. It's really pretty. It's really bright and colorful and it's going to be a lot of fun to fill out. Um, this is last month. This is February. I haven't filled it out yet. Oh, one day, but um, let's see, January. That's how January looked. I'm trying to going to start with a more filled out page so it's not just a bunch of writing. There's other stuff to see too, so I think hopefully I accomplish that. Um, if you like this, then um, please give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more from me, then I'd really appreciate it if you subscribe to my channel. And I will see you on the next one. Thank you so much for joining. Bye.